Georgia, are you wearing a fragrance this morning? It's orange. What about a bicycle? I once had Dorothy's original bike from the Wizard of Oz. I need someone from the props department. Ding. New blue tomato tomato. Once baby Judy died, I didn't want to ride it anymore, so I sold it at an auction. Yeah. When I was beautiful. I want... No trading. What about mine? I don't have a poster for you yet. You know, you're way too cons... I had a bike once, and it was red. Good morning, Chris. How did you get in here? Took the stairs, silly. And you are? Well, I'm Daisy. Daisy Adair. My patron of the arts. Oh, that's too bad. Now, how on earth could meeting me be bad? Because people who call themselves patrons generally only want to talk about how much a painting is worth rather than what they see, what they feel. Wouldn't one consider both? Art and value? Sounds reasonable enough. Nothing about painting is reasonable. How much? As in, how much did I want to paint that? How much pain with how much joy when I was done? Yeah. How much? It's not for sale. Well, doesn't your gallery set a price? I don't have a gallery. That's ridiculous. Your work is, it's pretty good. I mean, it could sell. Besides the, <laughs> I don't mean to be rude, but I'm sorry, I can't sell you anything. These things have a way of sorting themselves out. I like that painting. Excuse me. Excuse me. What the hell's going on here? You're done here, handsome. Now skedaddle, go, shoot. I have a straggler. What's the problem? He's over there. I see him, Daisy. What's the problem? I think he's got a crush on me. You, my friend, you're supposed to move on. I, I can't compel her. I can only... Uh, told you, Rube, I can't be responsible for every soul who wants a piece of me. What the hell do you think you're doing? You think it's a game that for yourself? No. I hardly think... You hardly think, that. Daisy, and I do. You, you... You're an acquisitive one. When your acquisitiveness interferes with my schedule, I start to come undone. It's not my fault he has feelings for me. I just have enough of this shit. Rube, what are you gonna do about him? You're a straggler, you're a problem. <sighs> Ugh. Sweetie, I know you don't like it, but here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna hang on to the painting for a few months, find a buyer, then I'm gonna collect a bundle. That's exactly what I'm saying. You don't care about art. You're a day trader selling short. Do you even know what it means to care about art? Pardon me, I am an actress. Huh? Are you trying to make me feel bad for not being famous? Because I'll tell you this, Buster, I have worked in very close proximity to a great many famous people. I asked you, what have you done that matters? That painting of mine that you stole, that matters. You said yourself you didn't have a price for it. I said I wouldn't sell it. You have no clue. I, I thought you enjoyed it. Nice watch. Thank you. So this is your new house? Yes. And I've had a very long day, and I really need to get my beauty sleep. <laughs> Daisy, do you know how long I worked on that painting? 
Two years. The day I finished it, I sat down and cried because I realized that I'd finally made something outside of myself. You wouldn't know anything about that, would you? This is the room. This is the best room. That window faces south. It catches the light. If you don't mind my saying, you could use more light. Well, that's just crazy. Look at me, I'm as light as a feather. <laughs> light as a feather? No. There's more. But you have to try harder. you didn't want me to have it. Well, good morning. Hi. This is Mason's place. He traded with us. Why? I don't know. He just seemed all sweet. Is he on drugs? Yeah, normally I would say yes, but uh, he just said if we're living together, it'd be nice for us to have a nicer place. What's wrong with you? You seem sweet. Your room's upstairs. It's in the back. It has a nice window, but yours is bigger. I thought you might like it, but you can choose. Then we're set. Oh, where's my, um... Don't worry, your frog's here, your frog's home. So are you, honey. Maybe the point of continuing to move through life and death was to find it. <laughs> 